The Supreme Court has granted bail to Nagpur University's former professor and activist Shoma Sen in the Bhima Koregaon or Maoist Link case. While granting the bail, top court has snubbed the probe agency NIA. The Supreme Court has said that there are no reasonable grounds to believe that accusations against Shoma Sen are prima facie true. Now, allegations do not reveal commission of UAP offences uh, restricting bail is what the court said. The top court has now allowed bail on certain conditions including Sen shall not leave Maharashtra without informing the special court and uh, she will have to surrender her passport as well. My colleague Radhika is still with us. Radhika, take us through the observations made by the Supreme Court in uh, the Bhima Koregaon case with, with respect to uh, Shoma Sen. That's right. Supreme Court has granted bail to Shoma Sen. In fact, she was arrested six years back in the Elgar Parishad case for her alleged links with Maoist outfit. Now, of course, some reprieve for her with Supreme Court granting her bail yesterday. She was, of course, charged under UAPA. Uh, she was among the uh, several accused. Six accused have been granted bail. Sixteen accused in total as far as this case is concerned. And yes, the Supreme Court, while granting bail, did take into account her advanced age, her uh, health issues, as well as the fact that uh, she was behind bars uh, for over six years. And also the fact that the trial is delayed. And also one of the observations that were made, that was made by the bench of uh, uh, the judges there also said, that the materials collected by NI only reveal her attempt to encourage women to join the struggle for a new democratic revol revolution and showed no attempt to commit any terrorist act. So strong observation there made by the court uh, stating that uh, prima facie it doesn't look like uh, Shoma Sen had any uh, direct links to Maoist outfit and Naxalite outfits or she was, uh, uh, you know, sort of aiming to, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, commit any terrorist act and so on. So that was something that was uh, part of the observation of the court. Of course, uh, uh, Shoma Sen being granted bail uh, six years after uh, she was incarcerated uh, as far as uh, this entire Elgar Parishad case is concerned.